let's see yeah but there's some financial concerns too or someone is wondering if you have a significant author bear in mind that this message can be vice versa where you could be the person thinking like this someone may be a, a criminal or a prisoner or something like that Someone was angry, upset too, jealous, waste time. Anyways, I don't know. I'm going to see what, what is the Ace of Cups? The Ace of Cups is new love, real love, self-love, self-worth, self-value, respect, having high standards. This person really just respects you, respects and um, values how you respect and value yourself, how you put yourself first. Wow, it's so beautiful. Like, they want to come at you with equal energy. They want to match the energy that they see you've already been, like, abiding in. They want to be a part of your life. This person, their eyes are full of you, seven of swords, and the star. The star card. It's like you are their dream come true. They're, they, they're all, like, stuttery and a loss for words. Like, they're mesmerized. They're, like... I can't believe this, like you've come true. This is how I'm feeling. Someone is feeling about you. Someone is watching you and they're like starstruck. You're just such a beautiful thing. You're just a dream come true. You make this person feel good, real, natural. And this could be how someone was making you feel like a natural woman, a real queen. Someone is just lifting you up, making you feel so loved. They compliment you too. They flirt with you. They give you all the necessary attention. And they're this dominant, prominent figure. Like a real leader. A militant. They say what they mean. They mean what they say. And they're giving you all of this attention. Sun card. Let's see. This could be a Leo energy too. Or this person. They, a blazing energy. They look. You are like the center of this person's universe. The center of their life. I wonder if you know that. But I feel like you don't know because it's all hidden behind the moon card. And it is hidden within this person's voice. Because with the ten of swords especially flipped over like that. There's someone that's just not saying that you are saying what they feel. They feel irritated bothered they feel grumpy they feel a fool they feel a weird way within themselves <laughs> for it's like imagine this person living in a dark tower going back and forth wanting to pick up the phone and call you wanting to type you a message but they they're just not they're um shy but you it's like weird for this person to feel so, because they are the king of wands and the fool card in this case, you know, like they are powerful, but they just feel like unsteady, unsure when it comes to making that move toward you because you trigger this person to, f it's like, you, <laughs> you made, you made this person feel like, uh, I don't know. This person is used to feeling big, strong, confident together, emperor. King of Pentacles. You know, nothing can stop me down. Nothing can slow me down. But you, psh, that is why they're agitated. And they're frumping and going around. Because they, you make this person feel like strange. They don't know what you do. Right? They want to pick up the phone and call you. Yeah, the t five of swords. But they don't know what to say. But you may find this person calling you to say just nothing at all. Say something weird. Like, did you... You may work with this person. They may call you. Because they've been thinking about you, like, really. Deeply, like I say. Um, but... <laughs> so they may call you and ask, did you pick up the mail today that you're supposed to pick up? Just because they want to find a way to speak with you. But it's nothing... It's kind of controlling... Um, they kind of are a bit controlling or out of control, but I'm not worried about it. It's kind of, you know, it's because we know that they're feeling how they're feeling toward you. Mm -hmm. Oh gosh, you see how long it took me to even explain that feeling exactly. Maybe someone is not used to expressing their feelings like this with the Ten of Swords. That is why they just keep watching you, waiting for the right time, but they're a bit impatient because... They feel like, what are we waiting for? Something about your curtains or white curtains or opening up your curtains or turning on the light 
or something like that okay so what is the three of cups they have good news for you this person something about your father and something about money paper money and someone may want to pay you and you're making money you're gonna be so happy seven of ones you're gonna get, learn some information as well about something that's making you happy three of cups everything is fine ten of swords seven i mean page of wands you're gonna and something is clearing up in your life too you're getting away made five of five of wands you're not a part of some drama or you're getting um you're getting a, an agreement or some grat gratuity something that you'd earned you know it's gonna make you feel like yes i'm on my way up and it has to do with your money okay so you could be getting a new job right even from this person the skin on one's energy that is like obsessed with you or it's something about your father for some of you or you're gonna get some paperwork or a word a clearing in your favor like yes 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 sage you may go along from a higher figure wow look at this twin flames from a higher figure of authority and this figure is so loving like imagine this is a judge and she's so beautiful she's smiling in your honor her energy is powerful yet so light and and so pleasing and she just say yeah you can go through for some reason and you got through mm -hmm. but she's not just a beautiful angel because i just saw the devil card and the three of swords because as soon as you go through you may see the wrath on her for real like as soon as you go through or make your way past, you may see fire in her eyes. Devil card, three of swords. We just moved from her being this beautiful earth angel. Okay. So, but I feel like you got by. You're supposed to probably get some money. Because, yeah, the justice card is here. You're supposed to get inheritance from uh, maybe a past person. Someone owes you. Yeah. And, and they don't want to tell you or they don't, they're, they're trying not to give you that information. Yes, going back to the mystery card of moon and the ten of swords and the death card. Wow. Yeah. There's some something was going on behind your back with the ten. Mm -mm. Nope, no. Yeah, we've got to talk about it. Like someone wanted to, to um annihilate another person, eat their food. And there's someone that knows the truth and this person is being charged. They're answering to this judge now. For what they were doing right some may look here yeah, something incriminal nating but um okay we're gonna leave these messages here hope they've been able to help you on your journey beautiful soul all the best all is within you no